out of the fire, get me out of the danger, whatever. I don't care. Oh. There is no way to... Okay. Well, that's not what I thought it was going to be. So, we. Alright, so what's the point of this shrine? I'm very confused. What is this? I don't see anything else other than this ball. Yeah, it just spawns another one. That doesn't change. Come here. Oops. No, I don't want to throw that. Pick it up. Is it wanting me to launch it over there? That might be what it's wanting me to do. Like this. Yep, that's what it wants me to do. Okay. I hope I don't break my ball or my weapons doing this. Come on. Where'd the ball go? Did it not even go far enough? If this breaks my weapon, I'm going to be mad. It's not even going far enough. Okay. Doink. Do it again. That should be perfect. Oh, come on! Lame. I was like perfectly straight on with it. Fuck! I was faced that way and it shot it that way. That's cool. Alright, I'm gonna just get a faster weapon. Great. Oh my god, I made it worse! Fucking god! <sighs> yeah, CPR training, they don't tell you that a lot of times. It's like, yep, you might hear a strange crunching noise. That's you breaking their ribs. It's like, uh, you should probably tell people that. That when you compress upon their ribs right there, that it's breaking the ribs, but a lot of people... Like, they don't understand that. It's like, and then they try to sue you for doing CPR. Which is really frustrating because it's like, um, okay, I could have just let you die then. The jerks. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. You're alive. You're welcome. It's like, yeah, your chest is going to hurt like hell for the next week and a half. But you know what? You're still breathing. But then some people sue people. It's like, they touched me inappropriately or something. It's like, um, there's video. They're not touching you inappropriately. They're legit giving you CPR. Because I've heard, and I don't know if I've actually seen a video of someone legit inappropriately touching someone and saying they were given CPR. You better fucking stay in there, thank God. But it's like, man, there's video. They're not touching you inappropriately. 
And if someone's really going to use that opportunity, that's fucked up. It's like someone's saving your life, man. Oh, another one. Okay. Yeah, those first bits are crunchy. Well, the shitty thing is, too, like, I don't know if you can hear this, but... Yep, that hurt. Um, something's up with my chest, and it pops constantly, and, like, that's why occasionally on stream, like, I'll, I'll pull my hand up here, and I have to, like, push my chest in so it, like, rearranges itself and pops. And I'm like, that can't be good. But it makes it feel better <laughs> temporarily. All right, do I hit that? Or the... What happens when I hit this? Hopefully this isn't messing up my weapons. Oh, okay. I thought it was like a hammer and it was gonna go up. Okay. It's gonna go really hard to go to the right. Okay. And it's far easier than the first one. Oh, done. Did I get... Where is it? Did I get the... Tre I did get the treasure. It was at the very beginning. It wasn't even hidden. Yeah, th they don't have the good Samaritan laws. Yeah, that's true. Like, well, uh, I need you to sign this waiver for me to perform CPR, CPR on you, Mr. Uh, passed Out Person. Messed up. Excuse me. I liked his hat. I wish I could have that. Or have that hat in, like, a Bloodborne. Oh, Yuri, uh, I got uh, a longer clip. Uh, I did a highlight of the clip that you got yesterday. That's going to be going up on YouTube as well tomorrow. It cracked me up. Aha! That's awesome! <laughs> the fog went away and it pointed me right at the horse head that I was trying to go to. Yes! Everything's going my way. Tell everybody I'm on my way With new friends and new faces to see And to sleep out on the stars, yes I'm on my way I mixed up multiple lyrics I don't care I love that song. The whole movie's great Um, That thing was a 7, wasn't it? Okay, whatever that could say there. Yay, opponent song! Horses! Look at them. Hi. Hello there, traveler. Welcome to our table. Will you stay well, won't you? If you have a horse, we can help you change its gear or main style. <laughs> We're always happy to meet new horses. So stop on by. Yay! We're gonna have to get me a horse. Hey, buddy. Oh, I just don't know what to do. What's wrong? Oh, crap. Thanks for nothing, but Oh, you're rude. What's wrong? Listen, if you want to get anywhere in this life, you got to catch and crash it. And the only way to do that in this day and age is to go. You stay with me here. Is to go to... Oh, stay with me here. I get it. Is to go with... Stay with me here. Hyrule Castle. I know it sounds crazy, but the rumor has it that it's full of abandoned treasure and weapons. They're just sitting in there, free for the taking. Well, if you can get past all the bloodthirsty monsters, of course. Go for it. <laughs> You're right! I can't let that smoking hot rumor like this go to waste. I just gotta act on it, bud! There's a docks on the north side of the Hyrule Castle, see? And here you can get inside the castle from there. There's also an ancient shrine somewhere around there. Smells like treasure to me. Stinks like it even. Of course, no one I know who's gone to Hyrule Castle has come back. Probably because they're too busy being rich. Excuse me. I just need to come up with a solid plan. 
Then I'll be living the good life. All right, buddy. You go do that. Also, we need to find the doggo. Doggo number one priority. Do I have any meat? I have three pieces of meat. Does he eat chicken? Oh, hey! Bugman! Hey! I don't believe I made your acquaintance! The name's Beetle, but you can call me... Actually, let's just stick with Beetle. But even if you forget my face, you can remember me that my Beetle-shaped backpack. Despite these dangerous times, you'll find me traveling all over Hyrule to fulfill your shopping needs. I stock many bugs and must have items for travelers. I always charge a fair price. Or my name's not Beetle. I also buy all sorts of things if you're in need of rupees. Gemstones in particular fetch a high price. How can I help you today? What do we got? I'm sure I have something you'll find useful. Please have a good look. I don't want it. No, 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 no. Thanks for your business. Goodbye. Thank you very much. I'll see you again soon. Oh, recipe book. Read. Tracy here. Awake or sleep? My quest for juicy rumors has rest ever. Doesn't everyone gas up in their sleep? Today I got a hot rumor fresh from the mill that is. Wait for it. An exclusive. And that special topic is... The mysterious Karak mask, or mask, mask. They say if you pour enough love into an object, a spirit will inhabit it. Something that's creepy has got to be true. And apparently this Korok mask really is inhabited by a spirit. If you wear it, supposedly take shakes and makes adorable weird noises every now and then. I need it. I hope that's real. Maybe it does that to tell you when friends are nearby and you can't see them. Who knows? Oh, does he help you find more Koroks? That'd be awesome. They see the treasure chest containing this mask is hidden in a tree hollow in a forest that makes people lose their way. Hmm, sounds like a tough place to find something. Luckily, word has it, there's a convenient trick to finding your way. Oh, that's, um, talking about the... The forest, whatever it's called. Welcome. Do you be staying with us? Regular bed costs 20 rupees, a soft bed is 40. Never mind. Come see us again. Thank you. Oh, sleepy person. Sleeping. Bones, floaty, floaty. Alright. Nothing. Nothing else. You got something else to say? Oh. Welcome to my stable. We deal in things horse related. We also double as an inn. Hmm, I haven't seen your face before. I was literally just in there. Do you know about the stable system? I do. Oh, pardon me. Let me start over. Yeah. Welcome to our stable. If you come with the wild horse, you can register it here with us. Or if you want to stay for a rest, please head to the counter inside. So will it be? Peace out, yo. Alright, we'll be here if you need us. Me neither. Try not to get yourself killed. I will try my best. Oh, hold on. Looks like I missed a bunch of stuff here. Because upon touching them, you take on all his liability. It happens to that's messed up. <laughs> Don't try to get yourself killed again. That's funny. Ooh, I'm gonna. I need to. I need to cook some food. Cause uh, I'm hurting for foods. All right, two. I don't want to cook all of those because the Koroks like them in their little special, whatever they are, statues. There is a sort button. I need to use that. I was like, I thought food was on the first page. Why are the monster parts there? All right, sort is Y. There we go. Cook a bunch of these. Also, he said meat. I'm gonna try to figure out what that was. Actually, I don't need to because I have his 
Warm Dublay, Deblet, whatever it is. Alright, there we go. Good enough. Do I have some Endurish? I do. Let's cook some of these too. Alright, what happens if I just cook one of those mushrooms? Oh, wow, that's actually kind of good. Then it's not a waste. Oops. Whatever. Ooh. Kind of like that. A lot of stamina there. What if I do four? Oh, it gives me a full bar, but it <laughs> four things is what- I found the doggo! Yes, yes, good morning. If you're making time to talk to an old man like me, you must be in need of something. You aren't from around here, are you? Oh, when did you get my age? You can tell just by looking at people's faces. This year, woods, Woodland Stable borders the Elden region of Hyrule Field. It's a central fixture for travelers. Also, the Great Hyrule Forest, which is where his stable got its name, is right over yonder. Did you want to tell me about surrounding areas? No thanks. I see. Well, safe travels. And there's the doggo. We found a doggo. Oh, who's a doggo? Doggo. Alright. Doggo. Hi, doggo puppy. Hi, doggo puppy. You want some foods? I'm gonna give you some meats. It's gonna be delicious. You're gonna love it. Here you go. Here you go, you want this? You can have this. Here you go, it's delicious. Yum. Oh, so good boy. Oh, get the drumstick. Om nom nom. Om nom nom. Get them drumsticks. Yum nom nom. You want some more? Here you go. Nom nom. Get them drumsticks. Om nom nom. Oh, so good, yo. Om nom nom. Jade is all looking at me like, you're not talking to me, Dad. You're gonna follow me? Look, we are friends. We are dog a friend. Here you go, buddy. Here's another one. He's got. He got. Get him to the birdie drumstick. Nom nom nom. Good dog. Oh. Wait a minute. I thought I only had to feed him three pieces of meat. I don't think he'll eat fish. No. Oops. Uh, sort. I don't think he'll eat fish, but I'm gonna try it. Here you go. Nope. I need... Meat. I need meat! <laughs> try not to kill these... <laughs> goats here. Oh, neat. More mushrooms. Oh, a rupee. Neat. Oh, a double axe. Dope. Need that. It was 18, wasn't it? Yeah, buddy. Dang it, dude. I'm getting full on all my stuff. Nice. I need food. Or meat. Any meat anywhere? Oh, listen. Balloons. Oh, there's a balloon kid. I sometimes see it in my dreams. Do you think there's a long time ago people used to live in the sky? I think so. Hey, mister. Just once in my life, I want to see balloons float right up into the sky. If you help me realize my balloon dream, I'll give you treasure I got from the sky as stinks. Thank you! Now put some blooms onto a barrel and make it float up high. Oh, I think I literally just got those monster parts that can do that. 
I don't even know what they look like though. Right there. No way. 